Hey guys, Antonio here with some more of The Way of the Superior Man by David Data. Today we're going to be talking about chapter 4, I think it is. Know your real edge and do not fake it. Um, so what is your edge? Your edge is the place where you stop living and you give in to your fears. The place where you have reached your comfort zone. Basically, imagine your edge as like the circle, the, that, the circle or the solid area that defines your comfort zone. That's as far as you comfortably can go without being in any sort of discomfort, pain, whatever. Um, basically, wherever you don't have any fear is with inside of that edge. You want to start living on the edge, pushing that comfort zone just a little bit every single day. Um, and if you hang back, you know, if you aren't really living at that edge, then other people can't trust you to help them live at their edge. Because people always need to be living at their edge. Um, a lot of people don't end up doing that, which is the sad part. And um, in order to become a free man, that is someone who knows where his edge is and doesn't shy away from it. So knowing what your fears are and saying, okay, I'm not going to be afraid to do it this time. I'm not going to be afraid to, uh, I'm not going to let my fear take control of my life and not be able to help, help use it to help me move forward. So... Hope you guys like take this lesson and really try to stay on the edge of that comfort zone at all times and don't bounce back from it. Don't stay back. It's better to know where you are and be available and showing it rather than um, letting it own you and acting like you don't really have that edge and you can overcome it, but in reality you're afraid. So it's better to be truthful and honest about this situation than it is to lie about it. So, hope you guys enjoyed today's video on knowing your real edge and not faking it. Leave a link in the description down below for you to purchase a copy of this book. Always highly suggest it. And this guys, please subscribe and have a wonderful day.